So pink pad material in general is going to prevent sliding, pressure reducing, shape conforming, moisture wicking, breathable, latex free, fire retardant. It'll probably do your taxes too if you ask it. Just kidding. Um, it's just like a bad morning joke I like to start with. But anyways, um, so for the pink pad, easiest way to attach it or, or what I kind of always say is um, for the straps here, we make the straps extra long, so if you need to put a bariatric attachment, which I think we had to do for one case while I was here, it'll actually reach all the way over. But I like to say, just wrap it around the nearest eye bolt, and I always just like to double wrap it. These straps are really strong, so you can pull these tight. You won't be breaking them. To the uh, eye bolt closest to the lithotomy strap, so I just like to go around and over, just so it's secure on both sides, and then go tight, and then velcro it, just like that. So, now, um, for the lift sheet, usually put that about a hand's length away or about six inches above the perineal cutout. This is just going to go right under the small patient's back. Now, we do make this thin so it, you can maximize skin contact. As long as the patient's sacrum and scapula are firmly on the pink pad, they're not going to slide anymore. So, so, if you can get them kind of positioned before surgery um, where you need them and then intubate from there, that's the best course of action. If you have to kind of move them up and down and they are a bariatric patient and it is going to be harder to move them on here. What you can always do is just throw a full lift sheet over this, intubate, move them down, and then log roll them twice to get the lift sheet out. So it's just kind of a little, little tip or trick. So you can just go over and then under the patient, or you can go over the arm and under that way, whatever the facility preference is. I don't know how it's going to look, but uh, it's gonna, it's not gonna be like a shoulder bolster per se, um, but it's kind of got to use a little bit of imagination here. But what they're gonna both be crossing, crossing over each other. No, what you, what you could do too. The patient's big, so you can do one across the thighs, one across the ankles, and then two across the chest and pull it out. That that would work too. So. Do you get extra straps? Sweet. Thank you. 